hit that third target and it was good for good for a 27.94 percent drop call it at 28 percent this was my third target here collected the profit and we didn't even react to it we, we waterfalled right through it we put in a divergent high we had a uh, really a uh, triangle pattern here. We had negative and bearish divergences constructing on all three indicators. We had crossovers on the MACD and oscillators break below their zero line. And here was that divergent high, nice divergent high. We uh, had a false breakout, came back in, back tested to that uh, 50 day moving average, came back in, we had another false breakout, call it a fuel uh, overshoot, huge force fueled overshoot and got rejected viol violently came back up that's how we uh, came out and formed that triangle pattern and here we go here are the next targets here um, you know straight from where I had said 2135 as being that key level and that key level it was an objective entry short and we cracked it came back up and we back tested it just as I had mentioned in my last video and uh, we we rode this whole thing down here and uh, you know good for that percentage drop next for that 14 17 at 31 percent of the drop um, if we hit that next target to 12 12 for a 41.3 percent drop so we'll see what happens um, keep you updated on it but these are the levels now beautiful looking weekly uh, head and shoulder looking top here and uh, that 12 12 level is a pretty big key level you know gun down almost near its uh, Corner crash lows there, and we've got other uh, little uh, one thousand zoom out even further here for you. But we'll see, we'll see if we hit it and uh, retest that 12 12 level right before that COVID crash. And I'll add some more key levels if we get there. So keep you updated on it, see how it plays out. Beautiful looking timed.